Hey guys, and welcome back. I just threw my money. Today is Monday, and it is going to be a rollover Monday. I went ahead and pulled out the extra cash I had in my wallet. It is 20, 40, 60, 65, 6, and 67 dollars. We're going to finish up some challenges, and then really quickly, I want to show you guys some stuff that I have been working on. Um, I did hit 500 subscribers, as all you guys know. So I'm going to be giving away um, a savings challenge for free for you guys to thank you guys for watching. Um, I'm going to be doing giving away the Halloween one, but this is a really cute birthday one. I can't wait to get this started. These will be on my Etsy um, starting this evening, I hope, um, or Tuesday, but I'm probably going to do it tonight. But they will be on there for um a dollar fifty for the savings challenges these are digital downloads here is the cute halloween one that i'm going to be giving away for some reason my printer printed this orange he's actually green like the hand i don't know but this is a really cute halloween one and then i have a happy thanksgiving one it's a roll the dice really cute and then this really really cute christmas challenge one so don't forget, you can head over to my Etsy and grab you these for $1.50 a piece. Halloween one will be a giveaway on the here until probably Friday, and then it'll also be $1.50. So you'll just send me a message on Etsy and just make sure you follow my shop and ask for the Happy Halloween Challenge, and I will get it sent to you. So... We have $67, so we're going to separate this. I might have to break this up, I'm not really sure, so that I can get these done, but, um, okay. So we're going to set these to the side, and we are going to, the challenges I want to complete today is this debt challenge and the mini rainbow savings challenge. So that's where I want to put this cash. And I pulled my ugly notebook over to the left side. You can't see it, but it is there. And then after we finish this one, we are going to start Ryan Collett's Level Up 2. And what better way to pay off debt than with free savings challenge. So head over to RyanCollett.com and snag you some free challenges that he creates. He does such a great job. So in this one, we need $10 to finish this. So we're going to put 10 in here and take out 10. I mean, we're going to put a 20 and take out the 10. So this should be 55 now. So 20, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, and 55. So let's, this one now is going to go in here. And if I can start this one today, I would like to start this one today. But um, I do want to do the back to school challenge and I need to make sure... I got enough cash to do so. So we're going to set this to the side over here. Pull in our ugly notebook into frame. Let's use the side that I always color on because why mess up multiple sides? And I'm going to take my marker container and we're going to pick out a yellow color in these and then we're going to date it on the back and add this to our challenges that we've completed so far and we have completed two challenges since i've started tracking this i just started tracking this in july for the year and now i'm seven months late well technically six because i did do these in july but we are going to keep track from here on out so we finished this on we ended it we started in july and we ended july i believe today's the 24th 2023 and because it's over the 50 threshold we are gonna take five of this let's get us some ones one two three four five and we're gonna add this five one two three four five two my um sinking fund slash emergency fund 
slash saving challenges. Not sure. I'll figure out where that's going. And then this 50 will go to a credit card payment. So we're going to come back here and add this to our challenge complete. I'm going to have to get something to put these in. So I'm going to leave this sticking out for now because I may come back to it. We will see. So this money needs to go to the bank. Let's flip to our back to school. And for back to school, I believe it's $35 that we need. So we have 11 plus 10 plus 8 plus 6. So 35. So we want to add 35 to this. And this is also going to go back onto the credit card. So 20, 30, and 5. And this should be now 120. So 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. So there we go. Let's give myself some more change just in case we need it. So 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Just because I'm not sure what other challenges I'm going to be hitting up. If we need more, I can come back and pull this. But there's 120 and I do need another $100 savings challenge to um, complete um, how much I owe for these school supplies. So let's get this colored in. I do know I want to put some money towards my winter hay. And you guys know I did not have dice, so I have ordered some dice, and I'm so excited for them to get here, and you guys get to see what they look like. They are so cute, because a lot of my challenges that I'm creating are dice challenges, and I'm also doing a few dice challenges right now, so it would just be smart to have some dice, so I'm not having to use my iPad every time I want to do a dice challenge. And I believe, oops, I colored that all in, but that's okay. I believe I started this one in July as well, if I wrote it on the back. I'm not 100% sure, but I think that I did. Yo, I started this one in June, but she's finished now, and that's all that matters. And yeah, she's finished. So if you hear my kids, they are still home till the 4th. Hello, I'm still filming. What you need? How long are you going to go for? Um, I just finished this challenge and I have to put money in savings challenges. If I go get videos, can you do addition? Can you go, um, I don't, what time is it? It should be done. Where's my phone go? Um, and then we're going to take, I know I have a lot of blue on here. I should have kept putting my markers separate better. And then also the all the challenges that I've created. I have a binder called Joy, and that's where those challenges will be going into. And when I stuff my Joy binder, you guys will see those. It's still too. Um, I should be done. Okay. So this challenge is done, and so far going back to the bank. Let's fix this. We have a decent amount going back. We have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 66, 7, 8, 9, 70. Is that right? 10, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 70. Yeah. So $170 is going to be going back on the card from where I bought school supplies and where we just had some money on that card. So that's exciting. So we're gonna take this 
and again i need something to put the finished savings challenges in so for now i'm just going to pull them out and we've completed these three so far so yay to completing two challenges today and I did want to add to my roll the dice challenge and since I don't have dice here with me today um, and I don't have my iPad, we're just going to get the pink marker and this is $6. Let's add a six here and see how many of these we can do. I might actually end up putting all of these, the money, the rest of the money into this challenge because again, this is for my hay for my animals this winter and I wanna make sure that they are good. One, two, three, four, five, six, so perfect. So we're gonna put that in here as well. I am almost there. I need $130 or 150 If I get the hay straight off the field, it's 130 If I get it from the barn, it's 150 So, I'm almost there. I don't need much more. Okay, so we're not going to count this right now because I don't need to, I guess. Um, so, we're not going to. So, we are going to put this back in here. I need to do a bill exchange for some of that that, might, that envelope is getting packed. let's see what we could do on this because i do feel like you know the smartest and responsible thing to do would be to continue on our debt journey and we're going to start this july 24th 2023 okay and we have ten dollars left i think i want to add this Hmm. I'm not starting the challenges I created today yet, so I think I'm going to just put all of this into other challenges, and I think I'm going to put this five into the sloth challenge, so we've got ten dollars here, so for that, we're going to do a pink and green, because those are two of my favorite colors, and we're going to do a six- Six, a three. And a one. And that is ten dollars already going back into our debts. And I say our because you know, like you guys are part of this. You guys you guys, if you have debt, do these little small challenges with me and knock it down a little bit at a time. You'll be so thankful that you did. So we're gonna add this 10 bucks in here. And I still need to do my, um, what's it called, my uh, uh, dashboards. I did do some tabs because I've got some suns and rose challenges I need to do doing. So I've got three tabs here. So, um, I'm excited to start those as well, but that will probably be in a few weeks. So, let's take out our sloth challenge. And the sun's, um, challenge I'm doing and then her support challenge that I'm doing. So, let's take out the sloth challenge. Actually, you know what? Let's put the five in Christmas. I think putting it in Christmas is the way to go here. So let's put the sloth money back. Um, I've been putting a bunch into sloth anyways and kind of neglecting our... Oh, I don't... Oh, I do have it. Our Christmas. So, let's pull... This is the joy binder I was telling you guys about. So joy, and we have the different categories in here. My other challenges I created will be going in here, and I'm still working on a 4th of July, Mother's Day, Father's Day, you know, and so forth. So Christmas envelope is in here, and for Christmas, we do have our um, challenge book that I got from Gentle Charm Budgets, and we are working on the very first one, and this will be $145 when we're done. 
And just to confirm, we've got one, two, three, four, and five. So we are going to color in this little one right here. Are you guys ready for Christmas? I cannot believe it's so close to being here already. I'm kind of thinking about on our property, we have a huge front yard. And I am thinking about planting a Christmas tree right in the middle. And then from the time it's tiny to like huge, um, decorating it for Christmas. And then like, you know, for Halloween, we could put like Halloween direct directions decorations on it and i'm just trying to think of like if that's what i want to do because like if you know like christmas trees can get like huge right so i'm just trying to decide if that is what i want to do and if it is this christmas season i think we're gonna grab one and plant it i also want to um do something special just on my property in general because as you guys know, we have a farm, farm channel, linked below, um, Polly's Homestead, go over, check it out, watch our cute animals, we got bunnies, quail, chickens, goats, pigs, something for everybody's gonna like it, okay, we still need to get a cow though, but I'm thinking about doing, like, some kind of something for the animals, like, I don't know, like, something Christmassy, something in one of the videos, but I don't know, I don't know. In here, we have 20, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, $47 in Christmas. I need about 1K for Christmas. So, the girl is behind. But, I'm also paying off debt. And I know our card payments, like, when I get it paid off, like, that would be extra income to go to. So, you, like... I'm not that worried about it because I know I'll have extra cash to like throw to these. So it's not the end of the world if, you know, you know. So real quickly, since I showed you guys those challenges, you're going to skip all of my notes and binder. I am a paper person, guys. Like, I don't know. I have a paper problem. We are going to put these in our joy binder so gifts i'm using for birthday oh i don't need to do that i do not need to do that so in the gifts we are doing this birthday one and i'm considering laminating it but i don't know what i want to do don't forget to go check out etsy to grab you one of these dollar fifty over there i don't I don't know if I have a print option on there, but if I do, it's probably not correct anyway, so <coughs> it's probably the wrong amount. I need to check, but happy Thanksgiving as I roll the dice. Super excited to do this one. These challenges took hours to create. I give it to all you ladies who can just pump these out, but all the different layers, like, you should see how many layers I have going into these challenges. It is insane. It is crazy. But I enjoy it, and it's it's a lot of fun creating it. And even though I'm not doing the Christmas one as of yet, because I want to finish the one that I'm doing, I'm still going to put Christmas in the Christmas binder. And it is going in here. Again, you can get all of these on my Etsy shop. 150 bad very affordable very affordable halloween really cute halloween one i really like this is so cute but it is gonna go in the halloween one etsy for one dollar girl 150 sorry not a dollar 150 is what i was doing and don't forget until friday this will be a free giveaway so just head over to my etsy shop Follow the shop. You don't have to purchase anything to get this, but follow my shop and send me a message and tell me that you came from YouTube and you want the Happy Halloween Saving Challenge. And I will get it sent to you, girl. Or boy, whoever. Whoever wants it, just let me know you're there and I will get it to you. But thank you guys so much for watching. 
I need to go and deposit this money and pay on that card to get that taken care of because we are getting a debt over here and I want it gone. So thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.